Okay, listen to this name. Nim Rat Deep. Nim Rat Deep. Good. Um, welcome to the podcast. I do Brazilian Jiu Jitsu four to five days a week. Not good for you. In one of your videos, you mentioned how things like bear hug carries would teach you to control your breathing while exerting pressure, which hence will be helpful in grappling. Yeah, and that particular video has uh, reminded me never to ever talk about grappling again because now everyone thinks I'm an expert on that. And frankly, I don't even know the first thing about it. I don't know if I care. Could you please talk more about that idea of which exercises can be helpful in jujitsu? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I read Frank Shamrock's book, and I think he does a lot of tumbling. Uh, they have pretty poor techniques in the clean and jerk in the book. Uh, there's, there's squatting in the book. I mean, to me, it would just be traditional exercise. It, just getting strong would be always a good idea. I mean, in just my 25 cent opinion, bear crawls and bear hug carries would be great. But I mean, what do I know? Um, I mean, I've already had someone pan what I said about bear hug carries. And, you know, I don't know why you'd ask a, friend, uh, a strength coach who doesn't know anything about a sport about the sport. But uh, I mean, so I give a very, uh, <laughs> I give a, a, you know, a fairly experienced answer. And then someone came online and said I didn't know what I was talking about. And they're right, I didn't. And I admitted that. But yeah, bear hug, uh, bear hug carries. Farmer walks for the grip. Uh, any kinds of sleds or prowlers are always a really, really good thing to do for any sport, anytime. And just the basics of weightlifting. But really, the, the best you, the best fighters, grapplers, whatever you guys call yourself this week, they're going to be the people who have been on the mat the longest uh, with the DNA and with the mindset to be good. So, by the way, it's true about everything. Thank you for your question. Nimrat Deep. Thank you.